So Shane, can you tell us a little bit about the, XD, the new XD Cami X camera? Sure, what would you like to know? Uh, it's based on a new card system, how does that work? Yeah, um, okay, well first of all, we'll just we'll back up and we'll talk about XD Cam. It's got XD Cam on the front, but it's not recording on a disc. So what we need to think about is what XD Cam is. XD Cam is more than just the disc. XD Cam is actually Sony's next generation non-linear uh, camera platform. So the first implementation of that platform was using the professional optical disc. If you look on a professional optical disc, you won't see XD Cam written on it. Okay? So, we, so we chose the professional optical disc because it's robust, it's cost effective, and it's cheap data per gigabyte. Um, when and now you've moved to a 50 gigabyte version of that. Now we are moving to a 50 gigabyte version of it. So, and, and that was always intended. So, with you know, the professional optical disc implementation of XD Cam is still relevant uh, as a as a as a very broad general production tool. It's you know, it means that with um, non-linear record media, it's affordable enough to give it to your client before you get his credit card number. The solid state, the flash media recording, uh, when um, when the P2 card was chosen, we were asked, why why not? What's wrong? You know, this is obviously the future. Why aren't you doing it? Well, there, although they weren't discussed at the time, there were very good reasons. One is the P2, the the PC card, the PCMCIA card. It has been halted as far as further development is concerned. And most of the new laptops and things have moved away from that sort of um, connector, haven't they? That's right. And and at the point where the P2 card was implemented as a record, uh, as a video storage media, we knew that the Express card was coming. So we just didn't want to go that way. So we've waited a couple of years and now we're, we're uh, introducing what we believe is a, is a, a viable growth um, path with the Express card. Um, the Express card is, has, um, has much higher uh, data density capacities. It's smaller, it's uh, more uh, heat efficient, doesn't use as much power, and um, and, and because it's non-linear, it's got the XD Cam name. And because it's non-linear, it is got the XD Cam name. Yeah, but the card itself doesn't have the XD Cam name. The camera has the XD Cam name because it's it's part of that camera platform. And that camera platform in, it involves proxies, it involves thumbnails, it involves all the things that we know of as far as XD Cam. The only thing that's really different is the fact that it's smaller, cooler and it uses express cards. That's great, and so it's a half inch camera, is that right? That's right, there are three half inch chips in it. They haven't announced what those chips are, whether or not it's just a simple implementation of the, the three half inch CCDs that are in the current half inch XD Cam HD products, or whether they've got something uh, new and special in mind for us. But it's a, it, it's a native 1080 chipset, um, and it will support um, it'll support 1080i, 1080p up to you know 2530, and it'll also support uh, 720p up to um, 50 and up to 50 or 60 frames as well. So why is Sony putting 720 into a product now? Why is Sony putting 720p into a pro product now? Because the market wants it. Um, it just makes it the most universal, you know, supporting all the formats, you can then cover all the bases really. That's right, it's versatility. Versatility is part of XD Cam, you know. Um, you want, we wanted to try and make it as, as multi-purpose as possible, to try and help our customers work within their business case, within their business models, you know. If, if we focused on one or the other, we'd alienate someone along the way. And when is it expected to ship? I'm not entirely sure, but I think it's about October. Okay. And the price? Uh, the price that they're talking about here on the standard NAB is a, a list price of around about 8,000 US. Wow, that puts it into a very affordable category. Uh, absolutely, absolutely. But I don't know if they'll throw in the cards with that. Well, thank you, Shane. Thanks very much.